where my issue with case studies comes in is depending on what subject it is, sometimes it's pushed so far back that it doesn't create value for a student. So for instance, if I'm doing digital marketing and talking about case studies from 2012, yeah. the digital sphere has changed totally so changed. different yeah. that what I'm learning from 2012, even if I found the solution to that problem, the problems that exist now, that is irrelevant. Yep. Technology moves too fast. So I'm, I'm for case studies, but I'm also somewhat against it because it's looking into the past, not the future. Okay. Yeah. But balancing that off, I still think the application side is what students in business really, really need. Yeah, just in general, we need yeah. more. Um, okay, yeah, so that, and then, I'd say I'd say group projects with incentives. So actually, I'm realizing as I'm reading this pros list that there's also a cons list yep. because these pros are stuff or things that I like noticed like once or twice mm -hmm. out of like they're opportunities. I would say I wouldn't say that they're necessarily like even the cons pros, as well. Yeah. I, I think all of this is like an opportunity for yeah, universities. Yeah, that's a much better way of looking yeah. at it. But yeah, like out of the like I don't know 46, 50 classes I took, only like two or three had projects. Mm -hmm that had practical value and which put you in a real life situation they weren't like kind of just made up situations which i mean to to some extent it's fine depending depending on the course but like for example one of the courses i took put us in a group project which was defined as like a consulting project which excited me because i mean i was about to start working at deloitte too so yeah. it's more of a consulting thing and so that excited me, but what else excited me was that it was more of a competitive environment, but in a good way. So it was like, you're not kind of just doing this for yourself, mm. but it's like, you're more motivated by like, oh, I want to come up with the best solution um, because I really care about the school. Yep. And the other thing is that with the competition came incentives. So like I just said, like you're doing better for the school. So this project involved the business school as a whole so it was a big deal and it was the first time this professor was new to the university it was the first time that i had seen and many other people had seen like a project that directly involved the school and which like all the projects which would go into actually providing up actual yeah. legitimate benefit and that benefit has been seen so like we had to i, I think we had to come up with like a program like a what is it, experiential uh learning experiential Something like that. Yeah, like a learning strategy kind of for this university. Yeah, so um, that was exciting because it was like, one, I'm passionate about helping the school out. Two, it was fun. Three, I got to do it with my friends. Four, it was well guided, well taught. And now, I mean, my team didn't win, but like everyone's ideas went into like a program now called our lead, our lead or something like that. Mm -hmm. So which incentivizes a lot of students to gain more practical value outside of the classroom. So it's like a win-win situation for everyone. It's pretty fun. It's awesome. Yeah. Um, another course taught by the same professor, another one of his projects, it was a different kind of incentive where like it incentivizes you to actually work hard because okay. there was firing involved. So the team mm -hmm. was allowed to fire one of their members if like they weren't you know participating that kind of thing and like everyone was ranked like co consistently throughout the course okay. so no it, it, it was a lot but like and there was a lot of work in that class but i think just schools need more of that just know, that, general, that's yeah. that's real world application like, yeah absolutely like you can <laughs> actually get fired exactly that's how the real world works like if you're not performing you're not doing your job and you're not creating value for a corporate company as much as you might hate it you're gonna get fired like that's yeah. just how the real world works so i think that's that's those are both super super valuable yeah